So I just donated blood at the American Red Cross um, close to my house. You can actually find the drives that are in your area pretty easily online. Um, but I thought it was really great to be able to donate. Um, I actually had to receive a lot of blood when I was going through cancer treatments. Actually, probably about 20 units were given to me at least. Um, so I definitely felt like I needed to go and give back and it felt really good. It took less than 20 minutes to go through the whole process and actually give the blood and then another 15 minutes to sit there and wait and just make sure you're okay. So it's actually a pretty fast process. I thought it was about an hour, but it's way less than that. Besides saving lives, you can actually get a lot of benefits from donating blood. They do about 14 different tests, including the COVID antibodies test. Um, that wasn't one of the main reasons why I did it, because I felt like I wanted to give back, but it was definitely a plus. Um, they also tell you your blood type and where your blood's going and all that cool stuff, and I thought that was really interesting. Also, if you're worried about answering those awkward questions or anything like that, you can actually do the questionnaire online the day that you go and donate. So I thought that was pretty cool that you don't have to sit there and talk to a stranger about certain things you might not want to talk to them about. So, if you haven't gotten the vaccine recently, um, it's about four weeks time, you can actually go and donate blood. If you've gotten the vaccine recently, you're going to have to wait a little bit, but I definitely recommend it.